It might not be the be all end all cancer cure we've been waiting for, but scientists seem to have found a breakthrough method for testing how good cancer drugs are at doing their job. It's called mitopriming, and it's a technique that was originally used to try and study how cancer cells die, but now they found that it's actually very good for identifying how well cancer drugs are doing at their job. It involves making a cancer cell produce an equal amount of a protein that protects them, called BCL2, and a protein that is poisonous to them. This results in the cancer cell still being able to grow, but it also becomes highly sensitive to chemotherapy. They also become very sensitive to a type of cancer drug called BH3 mimetics, which targets the proteins that protect a cancer cell. As they attack these proteins, the ones that are poisonous to them are still let inside. The hope is that they'll be able to figure out which of these BH3 drugs do this job best, a lot faster than they previously could. And although it's only in late stage clinical trials and isn't available for public use, it's already kicking up a storm within the scientific community in its progress for treating some forms of leukemia. The researchers behind this are from the University of Glasgow in Scotland and they say this method will help speed up the amount of time it takes to test new anti-cancer drugs. They also think this method will help them be able to identify how it is that some cells become resistant to drugs in the first place, which would eventually make cancer cells not immune to any of our drugs. That will be a huge breakthrough and a pretty awesome day. But until that day, thanks for watching IO guys. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date with all our great videos on this channel. There's two of them floating over there right now if you want to give them a click. In the meantime, thanks for watching IO. My name is Danny Burke and I'll see you very soon.